What's up? Thanks for clicking on this video. Today I'm going to be doing a block animations video because on the screen here is the comment. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to help you out. So here is how to do block animations for M Creator. This is going to be a really simple video, probably a pretty fast video. Um, but yeah, first you need some type of software that you can pixelate or draw or paint. Uh, I use paint.net. Uh, in the description, there will be a download for mcreator and paint.net. Alright, also, while you have that loading up, go ahead and go into a folder, like a tutorial folder. Make sure to create a tutorial folder. I did that last episode. Uh, go and press new, press folder, and go ahead and name this something like block underscore animation. All right, uh, it's just so that you have all your animations here because you're gonna have a lot of different photos for your animation. Uh, you can have as little or as many animation um, like photos as you want. So you could have hundreds or you could have just like four. So I'm probably just gonna do a little bit um, since I'm trying to make this video. I'm gonna try to make it a little bit simple, but what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make a block with a light that just goes around the corners. It's not going to be anything fancy. It's just going to be a quick animation of a light that goes around. So I'm going to speed this up. You guys can watch it. You guys can slow the video down if you want to um, see what I'm doing because I'm going to speed it up. Now that you are done with the animation, uh, go ahead and close out of that and go into mCreator. Alright, once you have mCreator open, go ahead and at the top left, this super, super small create animated texture button. Once you're on the screen, go ahead and at the bottom left, click add frames. Now locate your folder. Now you'll see all of your pictures for your animation. Go ahead and enter them all in. After you enter them all in, test if it looks good. As you can see, mine does not look that good because it's not looping. To fix this, all you need to do is pause it and then add the frames backwards. So do from 10 to 1. After you have done that, test it out again and it should look better. Alright, I know mine is not that good, but at least it's not as bad as it was. And then at the top right, duration of each frame uh, in ticks. So you can put this number up if you want the animation to be slower or if you want it to be faster. I'm going to make mine faster just because I think it looks better when it, for mine. 
just uh, mess around with that setting until you like it. Go ahead and save this texture. If you're doing an animated texture for a block or an item, go ahead and do that. Alright, once you do that, go ahead and name it. I'm just going to name mine animated underscore block. Alright, after you have done that, press plus and then press B or you can click on the block icon. Type in the same name, create it. Um, if you made more than one animated texture, you can do a normal block, but I'm going to switch to a single texture block. If you are confused what to do on this page, go to my first video, how to make a block. Alright, as you can see, it looks a little weird, but that's because it's an animation. Go ahead and click on that and press select. The block will look good in game. I know it looks weird. Go to properties. Go ahead and make the block have a sound. I'm going to make mine sound like iron and metal. Um, and then it's going to be in a building block. Alright, I'm just going to name this animated light block because I want my block to be bright. So to make your block bright, uh, all you have to do in the settings is go ahead and go down to luminance and set this to 0 0.80. There you go, 0 0.8, and that should be good. That's like glowstone. Um, does it have gravity? You can check that and go ahead. I'm not going to do everything on here and tell you everything because I already made a video on that. But I'm just going to create the block like we usually do. Right. After you have created everything, do not press the square, the red square. I told you guys too on the first video that was a mistake. Do not press the red square, that will cancel everything loading. And you don't want that to happen, you want it to load. So just wait for everything to appear. Alright, once everything is finished, go ahead and press play. Alright, once you are in Minecraft, go ahead and make a world. While we're here waiting, make sure to subscribe and like because I just surpassed 1,000 subscribers and I'm trying to get to 2,000 before the end of the year. Once you are in the world, uh, go ahead and search up for your block. There's mine, light block. Go ahead and throw it down, and you should see the animation. I kind of rushed my animation so it wasn't that good. This goes for items too, there's nothing like different about items. Alright, thank you for watching, and see ya.